Hello, 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 and welcome to another episode of Crazy Town Gaming. My name is Jonas. I'm your host, and I'm here rolling solo dolo on this Madden 20 Browns franchise rebuild. As always, I'm playing offense only. I'm simming that D, and I'm using the balance playbook, rolling on all Madden Arcade. So we are getting into this next week against the Cincinnati Bengals. We are cruising on this season. The games have been pretty close. I mean, they haven't been... Complete blowouts, I think moving it up to the all Madden setting on uh, Arcade is helping with that. Uh, you know, I don't want to be a blowout, but I also Welcome don't want to hate myself every time I touch the controller. So, works out great for both of us. A little bit more entertaining and a little less stressful. I mean, all Madden is still difficult, I guess. So, but that's why we send that D. There's that wild card. Never know how many points the D is going to give up. So, let's go ahead. All right, we're going to start out with Chubb running him out. Ooh. Boom. Oh, God. I did I did lower the shoulder. I did get that user truck. Uh, I like running the ball, but I like throwing it even better. Oh, I don't want to move it. All right, let's take a look here. So, as you can see, I never use single back. Um, I like strong, dude. And I like I like the plays that have fullbacks. I, I'm, a, I'm a big fullback and tight end guy. Um, I don't know. I just a pro oh god. Go, 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 Mayfield. Running down a dream. Whew. All right, there we go. 22, I'll take it. Man. He's got a little bit of speed. I can dig it. Break that sack. Run away. <laughs> That's the best way to do it. We're going to pop the crack now. Everyone's going to be on crack. Tossing that crack. Not smoking it. Don't don't think we're getting crazy. All right. Ooh. Oh, my God. If you would have done your one job, friend. Like, you literally pulled to the outside. Why didn't you just block him? There was no one else. I would have ran for a touchdown. You know why? It's because the offensive line in this team is trash. So it's second and 11. I'm going to try that play action again that I tried before. This time we're sending Beckham deep. You guys better have a... Oh, God. Dang it. Again. Again, I'm going to have to run. But this time we got a spy. Ugh. Man, dude, I hate when they put a spy on him, dude, because then I then I can't run. And with this game, it's a little weird because it used to be once you started running, you could do, like, um, stiff arms and stuff like that. Well, if you're running and you try to stiff arm now, it, oh, my God, their run D is intense. I may have to pass it up. I may have to put on a clinic. Fourth and one. Oh, I hate your face. All right, I'll kick a field goal, dude. I am not above field goaling. It's just this kicker is garbage. Oh, God, please make it. All right, cool. Um, You'll still try to pass, dude. So, like, I'm trying to run. Dude's coming at me. I want to put up my arm for a stiff arm. And I throw the ball. Or I pump fake. Or I do something stupid. Um... I'm still getting used to the new the new aspect. I mean, hey, I've been playing the game forever. I, I can I can cope. I can adjust. It's just weird. It's a little weird mechanic. Oh god, you didn't block the guy. I thought you were gonna block. Oh my god, you stumbled, rumbled, and then you got to the what do you get? Eight, nine. All right. All right. So usually what happens is if you can't run to the outside, you're able to run up the middle because they have very good perimeter run defense, but they aren't good up the center. So let's go and see how that works. Uh, I think that is the case because I just I just split their D and ran for 17. All right, so it looks like looks like little uh, little Nick Chubb's gonna be taking taking turns. Oh my God, what did I do? I spiked the ball. That's the other thing I don't like about this game. It tends to be a little too sensitive on your uh, on your no huddle plays because. You used to have to really hold that crap down, and now you don't. And now I'm I'm calling no huddles, fake spikes, because I want I'm trying to hit A to get through the stupid uh, uh what you call it cinematics, and it's uh whatever man, it's all good. It happens. It makes it's a little bit it makes a little more. Oh my God, guys, come on, really? The joke? Were well, you just gonna let him dance all the way down there? He broke 19 tackles, dude. What do you got, Najoku? That's what you're doing? Just untaping your wristbands? That's what's hot in the streets right now? All right, dude. You're going to leave them wide open. I guess I'll take... Oh, you're taking taking 10 back. I got you. All right, let's take you back up the center. We'll try the draw. We'll go ahead and do that. A little bit of a delay up the center. 
All right. Um, I like how that looks. Yeah, that's good. Yeah. Oh, there we go. Get him. Break it. Break it. Break it. Oh, that's that's jank, dude. That shouldn't be what it is. But you know what? I'll take I'll take the giant touchdown. Let's do it. Let's spike it. Yeah. Dang, man. There was authority. I'll take I'll take it. I, that shouldn't have worked. But it did. It doesn't matter. They came right back to score again on me. But they're, that just proves they're up the center. Run defense is trash. Because I was running on the outside. I've only passed one time because I can run up the center like, like oh my god, really? Let's break it. I'll t oh, you grabbed me by the helmet and pulled me down there, friend. Dude, if you can run like that, why would you ever do anything else? But... I am going to do something else. All right, we got uh, three slants. Let's see how they do on play action. They are biting. All right. I am going to run, and he's coming. Oh, my God. What the F? That's exactly what I was talking about a second ago is I went to hit A to stiff arm. He hit A to throw. The dude tipped it. It got intercepted, and now I'm going to be down. Oh, God dang it, dude. That... You know, I say, why would I do anything else than run? I try a pass. I throw an interception. That's jank. Oh, my God, guys. Like, really? They they literally have no... They can't stop me going up the center. Please. I'm literally just... I, they are just spreading it open like the Red Sea, dude. Like, look. Whoosh. Gone. Right, I'm going to keep running. I'm actually going to try another play action. This time, I'm going to do this. I'm going to take Odell deep. Why not? Play action. Pump. Shays. Oh, there we go. All right, I'll call the timeout now. We'll call the timeout. We're now on the 23, so at least get three. Man, dude. It's just frustrating sometimes when they change it. Like, the controls have been the same for a very long time. And then they change them up for no real reason. And it, it just causes... I mean, I, I get it. Don't get me wrong. I do get why they do it. It's so people like me, who are used to a certain way of playing... What are we doing? No? No? All right, we'll, we'll, all right, we'll take the... I mean, you're up the center. Run defense is trash. Can I please have an up the center play? There we go. Spike that ball again. Show him what's up. Blat out. We'll take one right before the end of the half. All right. 24 to 17 at halftime. Give me that ball back. Uh, let's get right back up the center, man. If they're gonna if they're gonna let me go up the center like this, I'm gonna exploit it. I mean, what that's the name of the game, right? I mean, you have to exploit what the defense will give you. This ooh, that's not Oh god. What is happening? All right, all right. That's cool. Uh, let's get down to shotgun. I'm actually going to do a uh, screen. I like this wide receiver screen play. It's just something nice to mix it up. All right, so I'm going to watch and see if Beckham is covered as soon as I snap. If I am, I'm going to go with, go to Hunt. He is... Oh, God. Yep, so Hunt's open. He caught... Did not catch it. What is the flag? This could possibly be a push off. Offensive pass interference? You freaking kidding me? On a guy who didn't even get the ball thrown to him? How is that even a thing? All right, I guess so. I guess we're just gonna. I guess that's what we're doing now. I guess that's. I guess you can get offensive pass interference when you're not even the guy who had the ball thrown to him. It's that new uh, offensive pass interference play. Because usually you have to interfere with the ball being thrown to you in order to get the interference call. So, all right, what I get here? All right, so it's third and five. We're on the 30. I am going to... I like this strong flood play. It tends to work pretty good. Najoku, I'm actually... I can't bring him on a slant, so I'm going to take him on an in. So he is going to... All right, let me hot route him. He's doing that. All right, there we go. I can take it. I can dig it. There we go. I, oh, my God. What did he just do? Back. Oh, I threw off my back foot, bro. There we go. It even told me on the screen. Black, back foot. I guess we're going to punt now. We're on the 30, right? So watch watch what I'm talking about. You have to 80 yards in the air to go out of the end zone. So I go full kick. It's gonna. He's, this dude is going to kick it farther than any man has ever kicked the ball. 
grabbing the momentum with the He just hit that 70 and yards in the air to the to the end zone. But before when I try to half it, it goes two it goes two feet. It's a hard okay, we got it. We're cool. Alright, let's go ahead and take it up the middle. I'm gonna exploit him for all I can. Alright, let's get this going. Chubb up the middle behind the guard to the right. That guy's oh oh god, they yep, they what is happening? They wow. A lot of a lot of jankiness. It's cool, dude. Just because a game is jank doesn't mean it can't be fun. Um Let's see here. We'll try to run the outside again, I guess. Their outside, the perimeter is pretty good, dude. So, my guess is it's not going to work. Oh, look. Stiff arm. Oh. Right. Yes, juke into them. That's the way to do it. All right, we'll take it, man. We'll take it. All right, we will go. Um, we'll run a little bit of pistol, man. I guess that's cool. Ain't hey, something I, I really ran much so far this year. It brings in another tight end, which I'm not crazy about because my tight, my secondary tight end. Ooh. Oh, you know what? Actually, I'm sorry. I was thinking of a different thing. Yeah, DeValve is actually pretty good. So, you know, I may actually use this a little more because I like DeValve. I like the valve running plays. Actually, I can dig that, too. Oh, my God. He is more wide open than I could have ever seen. And sorry, friends. I tried to make it work, but you guys are trash. You all bit on the valve. Look at me hot routing to the proper way. Ooh. You guys are keeping it close, I guess. All right, we're going to try to run out of the pistol. See how that works. Oh, they're both going to pull over the block. Let's see how this works. Deval first. Ooh. Yeah, that didn't work out very well. I do like having Deval in, man. I, I can't lie. Last year, I had uh, Najoku and Deval. Still, they were the tight ends on the Browns. And I actually had uh, Najoku get hurt for, like, the whole freaking season in uh, one of these, in one of the games. And it worked out so good to have the have the valve on the team. He oh god go. Um, he did really well in the opportunities he was given. All right, we are going to mix it up now. We got what third and four. We're gonna try play action now. We're gonna try to get him deep. All right, let's see what we got. Ah, uh, two minute warning, huh? That's what we're gonna do now. All right, we're gonna try that. We're gonna try that again. All right, here's what we're running. Deep cross. Back him across the middle. Oh, God, he's open. There we go, Njoku. Njoku's just so much more athletic than the battle is. I'm not even going to lie. There we go. And now they start wasting their timeouts because they can't win. Uh, all right, we'll go up the center. We know how that's been going for me so far this game. Whew. Get it. Oh, and that's it. He's gone, folks. Let's do the signature. What is it? Just shaking your hands really fast. Whew. I've never seen a celebration so ecstatic. I know when I get really excited, I just shake my hands super fast. God, they score. Oh, I missed the extra point to make it to make it worthwhile. So now... Yeah, yeah, we got a lot of points on the board. Let's cut back in. Okay, and just kind of collapse under your own feet there. Man, my defense is giving up a ton of points. I'm not into that, but it's cool. All I got to do is run. It's second down. As long as I don't fumble the ball, there we go. And that's really it, folks. All right, we'll go down to the goal line. We will QB kneel it. Oh, I gotta go. I'm sorry. I gotta go. Special teams. Is it under special teams? Come on, dude. There we go. QB kneel. We'll kneel it out. And it's over. Cool. 
Another W in the books, friends. That is all the time that we have for today's episode. Please make sure to like, share, and subscribe if you like what you saw. While you're at it, check out all our other playlists, man. I got I got stuff with my co-host TNT Dynamite, Madden stuff. It's great. He has his own solo stuff. I I mean, you gotta check out our other stuff on our channel if you enjoy these videos. But for Jonas, I'm gonna be doing the in between the week stuff, hanging out, uh, scouting players, etc. If you want to watch that, stay tuned. If not, we'll catch you on the next one. But for now, I am out. It's the leadership. It's the toughness. It's the mock. All right, guys. I am here. I still got to earn more stuff before I can upgrade my coach because all the stuff I want to upgrade is more. Yay, I did my goal. What did we get? We did it. That's good, coach. 100% for the offensive line. I can take it because my offensive line is not the greatest. So we'll go in advanced week. Next week we play the Cardinals. Week 15. We're almost done with the first season, everybody. Already. Seems like it just started. Now it's almost over. My favorite part, doing the offseason. I can't wait for that. So we're getting there because we'll lose a bunch of players because I'm a cheap A owner and i never sign anybody for any money i get everybody as cheap as possible i would rather do more with less talent for less money and have money in case i want to sign somebody crazy so all right training's complete let's upgrade these players greedy williams all right all right nick chubb we're, we're slowly turning chubb into an elusive back it's not working out as fast as i wanted to oh you got extra points oh you do boom He's gonna he's gonna want the most ridiculous amount of money possible when uh when he it's his turn. So we are going to it should still be man to man. I'm making I'm keeping it man to man. All right, TJ Carey. I like to upgrade your man to man stuff. They tend to earn more experience if they match the scheme. I may adjust my scheme so I have man to man cornerbacks. Um, and then we'll just we'll just uh finish those guys off. All right. Let's go down to scouting players. We're getting to the point now where we are just filling out our scouting. First thing I want to do is make sure there's nobody left over that I need to finish their scouting, like this guy. All right. All right, we're good. All right. Let's go ahead and... Oh, I exited out. All right. We will go to unscouted. I don't really need... I'm not going to waste a first-round pick on linemen or tight ends or wide receivers. That's not really what I need at the moment. Um, Second-round pick. I mean, line depth is okay in the second round, I guess. Because um, some of the guys I have on the line are old. So I might as well start doing that. And then eventually... Oh, well, I guess I'm going to do that. All right, cool. All right, everybody, thank you for watching this part of the video. I know it's quick and short and just scouting players, but uh, we'll catch you on the next one. Leave some comments. I guarantee I'll get back to you. We try to get back to every single comment. But for Jonas, I'll catch you on the next one. I am out.